Good morning guys, how you doing? It is a Friday, hopefully it's going to be a fantastic Friday. New day, new start. So let me show you where I am. So guys, you remember, may remember I was sat outside this, um, at the bottom of the stairs of the shelter. I then carried on all the way along here along the Appalachian Trail. And I got to this point here, this is where I camped last night and I thought, oh, I know what I'll do, I'll walk down to the hurricane campground and pitched there so I rocked up there pitched there then a very rude lady came out so I had to walk all the way back I ended up camping pretty much about here I then this morning I've just then done all of this through the waterfalls and I'm currently here so I'm going to be walking all the way down here through here there's a high point up there and this is the raccoon branch wilderness up and out so to be honest i'd love to be bashing out the miles but it just really really depends on the train sometimes you look at the train and think yeah i'll be able to do 23 24 25 miles today and then you start walking and you're just reduced to like less than two miles an hour just because of all the rocks so um it is raining today which is not great but you know what it's only water right let's bash on and crap some of these miles out and done Hey guys, just arrived at the partnership shelter. I'm not 100% sure what time it is, I'm just double check. Okay, so it is 3.40 at the moment, so I'm just gonna have a quick look at the map and see how far the next uh, shelter is and the next, uh, the next goal as such. It is still raining out, but the shelter is absolutely gorgeous. It's got showers and it's even got its own cats. So that means no mice, total win-win. So this is what the ground has been like for the past couple of miles. It just makes it so, so challenging. So, so challenging to, to walk on just because it's you're just using all of your concentration. I really, so it's about seven miles to the next shelter and I really want to pick up the pace. And I just can't, I'm going so slowly, partly because I'm scared I'm gonna twist my ankle again, which, you know, isn't a good thing. But it's just really frustrating knowing that I'm going maybe like two miles an hour. It's just so slow. But sometimes you've just got to embrace it, deal with it, and wait for some nice juicy flat sections to, um, to turn up. All right, guys, I'll keep you updated. All right, guys, I'm gonna be showing you the view of Walker Mountain. Here we go. This is worth the, this is worth the, uh, the walking. And you get a view like this. Wowzers, that's pretty spectacular. Hey guys, so it is about 6.30. Um, I think I'm going to reach the shelter in the next sort of 20, 30 minutes or so, something like that. I don't think I'm going to be able to go any further just because it's about five miles to get to the next place, which is, which is where I wanted to get to, a place called Atkins. And there they had like a 24 hour garage, they had an, an inn called the Relax Inn, and they also had like um, something called the barn where you could get like buffet, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So I really wanted to get there tonight so I could go and have dinner, go stay at the inn, and and resupply at the garage but it's not going to happen so oh, I need to come up with a new plan of action which I'll do when I get to the shelter which should hopefully be soon. Woohoo! We've made it to the shelter. So this is Chatfield Memorial Shelter. Friday night, seven o'clock, and I have made it 539.4 miles. I'm not quite sure how many miles I've done today, but yeah, that'll that'll have to do. Um, 
Just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who has been subscribing and liking the videos. That's absolutely awesome. I'm going to leave it here for tonight, but please do come and join me tomorrow for another daily vlog of my 100 day Appalachian Trail Challenge. Massive thanks again to Flynn, who is doing an awesome job editing. So big thumbs up. His links are all down below as well. Chat to you later. Bye.